Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. On the night of April 23rd in 1940, 209 people, all African Americans, perished in a fire at the Rhythm Night Club in Natchez, Mississippi. The one story dance hall was once a blacksmith shop, a church, a muse stable, and a Coca Cola bottling company located just blocks from the city's business district. That night, the hall was packed with many people who had come to hear the music of Walter Barnes and his Royal Creolians Orchestra from Chicago. This event was hosted by the Money Wasters Club. The rafters of the interior of the club had been festively decorated with Spanish moss, which had been sprayed with a petroleum-based insecticide called Flit. At approximately 11.30 p.m., a fire quickly engulfed the structure. Due to the dry conditions, the treated moss generated flammable methane gas. The windows, the back door, and the side door of the building had been boarded up to prevent outsiders from viewing or listening to the music. The crowd was trapped. Many other people were able to escape through the front door and through knocked out windows, but many died from smoke inhalation or were crushed by the crowd. Van Meter Barnes and nine members of his band were among the victims. Local funeral homes were overwhelmed and many victims were buried in mass graves. The Rhythm Club Fire was the first recorded nightclub fire and today is ranked as the fourth deadliest on record in U.S. history. In August 2010, the Rhythm Club on-site memorial museum opened in Natchez commemorating one of our country's most horrific disasters. Hi, we are Betty and Monroe Sago, owner and operator of the Rhythm Night Club on-site memorial museum. And this has been your Natchez History Minute.